far. filled up fast. They really screwed themselves. Ah yes, getting one off a light bulb. Okay, getting that one off a light bulb. Quickly! That won't hold much longer! Time to save someone's life. So I can move forward. Just Everyone must evacuate the first and second compartments! Get to the upper base! First time I ran out on that and I died. Now, I haven't played through this game all the way. Quite a bit. This way! Quickly! I'll hold the door! Move it! Come on! And the life saved. Now, I realize it's cold, and they're all shirtless. I guess it wasn't cold then, but... Yes, I improved myself a little. You've got to be kidding me. Is this a... oh. <laughs> it's this door you go through. different when it's not frozen. They have really big hands. Captain, the rod shows formation of sea ice all along our course. The rod, as in the divining rod? Another clairvoyant gadget of yours. Sir, clairvoyance is for shamans. This is cutting-edge scientific equipment, virtually foolproof. Oh, that's good thing thinking. Do you know why it is called the rod? Well, yeah, you had it, sir. Named after a divining rod, a stick used to search for water underground. Was real popular back in the days of wooden ships and navigating under the stars. Times change. But some things remain much the same. The ship must respect you. You must listen to her, understand her, talk to her, live with her one-on-one -on -one for many years. Then you become more than just a captain. You become a part of something bigger. That's great, but isn't it just pretty words? Sir, it seems to me all you've got to do is hold on to the wheel. When are you going to let me drive, by the way? You don't waste any time, do you? Well, if you're keen, try this for now. <laughs> you got screwed, man. But yeah. Good relationship with the boat there, buddy. See how it turned out?
Loading screen. And I think I'm gonna end it here, f this first part anyways, because it's been about 15 minutes, so... Um, I will continue this on in the next video, guys.